I'm Wednesday's child, so I'm full of woe. I'm a cockerel. I'm a Scorpio. I'm on the cusp, Sagittarius, wise and just, fierce, proud, sexy, full of lust. The weather forecast that day for November's child got it right. Dry, rather mild, and fairly dull. <laughs> no. That's a lie. Uh, this is a poem I wrote. All of these I wrote in the last couple of weeks, in fact, so they're very short. Um, this is after Chagall's Deux Amoureux au dessus de la ville. Flying people. Now you're showing off, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> it's a lovely, it's a lovely painting. In a dream, my lover called me by a new name. I kicked off my Sunday shoes, and we rose above the complacent roofs. Wingless we flew and flickered like a dark flame across the milky sky. I sang to my lover. I sang of joy. I sang of our joy. I sang to him of my helplessness. I sang of my passion. Thank you. <laughs> Here is a, a little poem called Tags. Our mother's labels stuck to us for years. The clever one, the pretty one, the baby. She never saw us throw our wrappings off and fasten new labels to each other. Now, who's the mercenary bitch? <laughs> the domestic bore, the cracked one, the sound one, the risk taker, the whore, the victim, the saint, the failure, the success. We've all tried on each other's clothes, as sisters do. <laughs> um, is this going to be a really short one? This is, yes. Th this is called The Widower. His children have brought him a chair in the, cre in the crematorium garden, where he takes himself on Sundays to sit beside her. He shows me a photograph of the chair with the poem their son wrote engraved on the back. He has the innocent eyes of a frescoed cherub. He tells me how they arrived too late after it happened, after the call, after the operation. He speaks at length, eagerly, bringing back her warmth upon his tongue. She beams her radiant smile from the card on the sideboard. The room sparkles with her memory. Four pink roses on the table. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm.